How's it going guys? We are back on Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. It's been a little while for the channel, but finally on Xbox we can actually access DLC for Bardock Alone Against Fate. And as if you've been watching the channel for any sort of amount of time, you probably already know this, but Bardock is my favourite character out of the series, or at least one of. So I have been really excited for this, and in case you haven't noticed or were unaware, the main thing about this is it came out on PS5 and was supposed to be coming out uh, for Xbox as well roughly about two weeks ago now but Xbox had an issue going to the Xbox Series X so they released a couple of statements and all this sort of stuff and apparently they've been working behind the scenes so on Xbox we're finally here we can access it we've got the season 2 pass and everything seems to be resolved Granted, it's about two weeks later, but it is what it is. So finally, I can actually jump into the Bardock Alone Against Fate. Without further ado, let's get into it. And if you haven't already, guys, make sure to hit that like and subscribe. Let's go. Okay, so we're starting off for the cutscene. With Kakarot crying. We're going to see Broly. Let's see. I have been so excited On for this. I'll try and stay quiet the as much as possible. But the lone crying baby. The lone voice out. of a crying baby rings out. Kakarot. This is the DLC, if any, that I was looking forward to, and I've heard it's absolutely so unreal, so make sure to stay throughout it, guys. Yeah. Let me know Clearly your thoughts on the DLC down warrior. below, and the if you played it, yes or no. Low. We're probably going to no know doubt. a little bit of the uh, story, but I just want to see how they play it out here planet. in Kakarot. And we're probably going to break it up yeah. into different parts, depending we'll on how right. long the DLC is. I have no idea how long it is, but we'll see. So I've tried to stay away from it as much as possible, um, because obviously I want to enjoy it for myself. And not be spoiled. There he is, son of Bardock, Kakarot. His power may be low, but his voice sure isn't. That's true. By the way, do you happen to know where Bardock is? Yeah, where is he? Oh, he's probably already off on some mission. He's been gone for a while at this point. I would imagine he's wrapping things up right about now. Well, I guess we're gonna see. Also, like I said, guys, make sure to hit that like button and let me know if you're enjoying the Kakarot content. I did do it a little while back, um, so I do have the rest of the DLCs already filmed and things like that. If you hit that like button, then I will release them as well. So you can look forward to that. Okay. Don't know what you guys are, but... Look at it. Granted, this is on the Xbox One as well. Bear in mind, I've heard on the Xbox Series X and the PS5, it looks even better. But this is pretty good. We're going to have to fight like hordes and things again. Are we going to be able to go gr Great Ape as well? That's a question. So, there he is. This is the target, huh? Fasha, Tora, ready to get started? Shugesh, Bardock, <laughs> who am I forgetting? <laughs> Tora, Fasha, Forgus, Shugesh, and we've got Bardock. It's time to have some fun then. Let's do this! Oh, we actually go straight in for a fight. Oh, we are. One of them's getting away. Takes down multiple battles. Okay, so yeah, these are like the whole battles that we had in the other DLC. Have we got any moves? We do. Final spirit can. Oh yes! Get out of my way. Absolutely demolishing here. Okay, he's down. So how many have we got to beat? 80. Let's get this going. I just want to see it. Whoa, that looks absolutely unreal. Someone said to me not so long ago that we thought Kakarot looked terrible. I'm not too sure, you know. Okay, come at me. Everything! Okay. There's no way I wouldn't be okay. Alright, Bardock. Get out of my way. Come at me then, bro. Nice. 
nice, nice, nice. Look at them all just piling in. Crazy. We're going to have a lot of this in this Bardock playthrough, I expect. Because he obviously did a lot of this. This is basically his main sort of job, I guess. And this is obviously Dragon Ball Z Bardock, not Super as well. Um, from the Bardock's uh, story and all that sort of stuff. So. Alright. How did that go for you, mate? Let's go for a Z-Bass. Let's do it. Let's see what we can do. So we've got Bardock and his team. Oh 44 defeated, and that is it. Nice. This hunk of rock is finished. And that's it. That's all it takes to dig over the planet, apparently. Nice. So we've reached level 21. Well, quite low level, but we'll see if we can build that up. Ooh, another cutscene. Bunch of little worms. God, he's so rude in that city. West. You're mine. Okay. Is this where he gets kicked and gets the uh, psychic and all that? And so the inhabitants of the planet were completely wiped out. A typical job for the Saiyans who would conquer typical planets job. and typical prepare them for sale under the orders of Emperor Frieza. However, little did the Saiyan warriors know that they too would soon meet with a terrible fate. Yeah, imagine what if One scenario man, Goku's if Frieza didn't actually destroy Planet Vegeta. What do you think? Let me know down below what this do you think would have happened. I reckon they would have run riot, to be honest. Nice. Dragon Ball Z, Kakarot, Bardock. Alone against fate. Nice. Okay. They've put some time and effort into this. I'm liking it. Oh, they're all out on the lash. Friday night, boys. Which is coincidentally when this is coming out. Well, the DLC came out on Friday. Shugesh. No Bet you're loving it. it the <laughs> if only those heads weren't so easy to pound in. <laughs> Damn straight. Here's hoping the next plant's a better one, right? Bardock? I like the way that they've actually got the voices you know, in here this bit. Sometimes they it, don't do that. We've all gotten stronger. I doubt that there's any planets out there tough enough to handle us. <laughs> yeah, I bet you all have. You losers better Saying not hey. too cocky. Low class scum like you ain't gonna do crap. The hell? All right, bro. What was that? Just watch yourselves. Spend too much time dreaming about being on top. And you'll, and you'll end be up in buried. You're lucky you well, get sent to East. Same B, eh? We sprung out for some names here. Levels. That's right. Keep having fun picking on small time game. That's all you <laughs> <laughs> You bastards. Fair enough. <laughs> well, you're not wrong. We can't get stronger wasting our time with such garbage. True, I guess. You're tough guys, right? Maybe you could show us a thing or two. <laughs> With all right. Ah, come on, that would we're be all nice. Saiyans here. Calm the hell down. Yeah, exactly. Hey, That's it, Tora. You start. calm it all down. Ah, forget about them. And if we're going on power level, Bardock's got them all beat anyway. <laughs> huh? Oh yeah. Look, it's over. <laughs> Pretty high power yeah, level you got there, Bardock, is it? Forget about it. How high is your power level? We need to focus level? on our next job. Where are we heading? Kanasa. 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 Eh? Yeah, it's a relatively civilized planet. <laughs> so you're saying? It. I wouldn't say that. Considering the fact, it's going to be a full moon. We get there. You serious? Damn straight. <laughs> are we going to go hey, giant eight? That'd be crazy. That is the Someone's planet that he gets it. kicked in the neck or whatever it is, and then gets those psychic powers, starts seeing the, the visions. tremble. Monstrous march of the Saiyans. Yeah, interesting. All right, let's get into it. Oh, 
Okay, lovely little city there. New York in uh, 3033. Hey, Bardock! Shopkeep. Bardock. Wake up! Yeah, wake up, Bardock. What are you doing? Ah, he's had one too many, huh? I see. What the hell? You got work to do, right? Don't Look you at think his you ought to be getting ready. Where's everyone else? Yeah, he does get that late, doesn't he? Bastards. You are a real heavy sleep. Here, let me pay for the tab. No need. Tours gotcha. already covered it, eh? Glad he's on. Yeah, because this is where they go. Ooh! Eating food that just permanently increase the stats. Yeah, that's pretty similar. And we've got a bard off community token. Nice. Or so elm, elm bum or whatever you want to call that. That's right. Ooh, cool. Leave the hangouts. Let's see what else is around here. Nothing much else. Like your mustache too. Oh yeah. Bardock. Oh yeah. What have you got? I'll go ahead and give you a head. I hear Cybermen have been roaming around. Cyber Cybermen. Yeah. Supposedly they've been going. Shouldn't oh be yeah, is that your reason for having no clue. enemies out and Some about? Some say the things mutated. Huh. That's just stupid rumors, I guess. <laughs> sure. What? Okay, searching for key, so we can do that as well. Nice. So we're gonna be going up against a load of Cybermen by the looks of it. And I'll probably cut out a couple of those fights. Like I said, we're gonna get the main chunk in it as much as possible. Next job's on uh, planet. Make my way over to the Let's go to the launch pad. Yes, yeah, we can go. Okay, we know all this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn. Right, I think I'm going to do all the main story. And if you guys do like this content, I'll jump back into the sub stories. Like I said, you can do that by let me know down in the comments. And also, can we fly? Yeah, we can. Let me know down in the comments. And obviously, hitting that like button, watching all the way through, and things like that. Helping me out with the uh, YouTube algorithm, basically. Uh, hopefully. Okay, let's go to the launch pad there. Hell of a lot more fun. Got plenty of power now. All right, to the launch pad we go. Let's see. Okay. Fast forward just a bit. There you go. All right. Hey, hey, hey. All right. You hey, there. hey, hey, you there. Stand aside. Prince, Prince Vegeta is coming through. Watch your hey. mouth, grunt. That's Prince Vegeta. All right, mate. Come on. Out of the two of us, who are, who's really a grunt? Whatever. Stand to attention. Okay. Oop, actually hit my mic. Let's see. Uh, right. Vegeta as a child with Nappa. Prince of all Saiyans and elite Saiyan warrior. Huh? What the hell are you doing? Oh, uh, the voice. Right, just a second. What's wrong? Huh? Something caught your attention. Oh, from yeah. Scout, yeah. I, uh, it picked up a reading from that guy over there. Said Is that so? Impressive. Ten thousand. That's higher man. than yours. Really? My scouter's gotta be busted. Uh, <laughs> Ten thousand still no match for me. I'm going to get even stronger. The whole universe will tremble before. <laughs> yeah. You got that right, Prince. But so Bardock had a higher power level than Mappa. Did he? Didn't even really know that, to be honest. <sighs> Man, them stopping by like that made me real nervous. What? Yeah, yeah well. that brat. He's just as freaking. That's for sure. Oh, I, 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 didn't... I meant to say that's our Prince Vegeta for you. Nothing I'm like not my kid. Like it, He's yeah. Prince Vegeta, huh? Hey, hey, you listening to me? I'm serious. I thought he was just some spoiled brat, but looks like I was See, wrong. Know who he is? Sure hey, he knows you hearing me? Huh? Um. Please don't tell anyone what I said, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Well, that was whatever. Yep, whatever, exactly, Bardock. Right, um... Can we... Kid, Prince go Vegeta, somewhere now? At that Ooh. age, his power level's probably higher than mine. Guess he's gonna be the new king. <laughs> that ought to be interesting. Uh, right, okay then. Well, where do we go? Head in your pods to Planet Canassa. There it is. Don't know why they ha hid the pod away from me. Okay. Hey, Bardock. 
Hey, dude. Next job's on Kanasa, right? It is, yeah. I hear there's gonna be a full moon over there. I wish I could join you. I wanna... <laughs> dude. You leave the ramp. Is that too late? Oh, it is. Yeah, something we usually say to you. Yeah, well... Everything okay. all taken care of? You bet. I've got your rations packed in there, too. All right. Hey! Let's move out, then. Bardock. Hey, Bardock. Come here for a second. Go on. Come then. here! <laughs> What we're gonna talk about Kakarot? What does he want? Well, if I know. Yes, so we know. listen. We just finished performing a checkup on the bull. His power yeah. level is extremely low, and he is indeed your son. The hair confirms it. Really? Out of all this technology you've got, the hair is how you confirm what the that. Hell? You right. called me over here for this? Oh wait, you don't want to see him? I ain't got time for that. Right, okay. Father of the... So, what did he want? Yeah, father, yeah, exactly. My son was just born. I wouldn't aspire to be a father <laughs> like uh, Bardock, to be honest. Not in this Come on. light. Let's get the hell out Maybe of the here. one I was super. Wait, hold up, Bardock. If you don't Should hurry you up, him? I'm leaving you behind. <laughs> what if... <laughs> what if... Extremely low power level, but becomes... Turns out to be one of the strongest Saiyans ever. So, can't always judge a book by its cover. Planet Kanasa, then. On we go. Let's see. I really do want to turn grey. That would be absolutely fantastic. I know some people have probably already seen it because they're PlayStation players, mm -hmm. but that would be awesome. These are definitely the guys that give the um, power of foresight. That? Or something yeah. along those sort of lines, anyway, isn't it? No, no clue. They don't seem like they have any idea right now. Are we going to have to fight loads of them? I think we are. So this is Kanasa, huh? Yep. <laughs> what a dump. I'm a bit rude. Not much longer till the full moon. <laughs> While we wait, why not warm ourselves up? Warm ourselves up, eh? Looks like they're thinking the same thing. All right! We'll split into Welcome two groups. Pie. Me and Fosh will go with Bardock. Why? Just let me do my own thing. <laughs> All right. No, man. no, no. Once you get started, there's no bringing you back. We're coming with. So, I'm with Borgo. Gets a bit overzealous then, does he? You watch yourself too. <laughs> Where should we get started? For now, let's head toward the city and see how. All right. Okay. Cool. So now we're gonna have a little uh, right, look guys. around Sinasa by the looks of it. And basically just build up a body count. Interesting. Well, okay, so we've really them up and we put the riot we'll jam in on as well, so we get to see what Let's that is true. like. I'm gonna do a bit of exploring, and we'll probably cut a little bit more into the story in a second. All right, I'm gonna bring you back here. This is the first fight against one of these guys. I am gonna try and build up our lab a little bit, so hopefully we don't struggle when we come to some harder sort of sections. We'll see, but these guys seem pretty easy. Level 18, no problem. Ow! No problem at all. Well, Tor helped us out. Oh, okay, we're actually here. Uh, I was just having a little look around and just taking some cutscenes, so. Yep. Like I said, I was just building up the orbs and things like that as we go along. Because we've kind of like got to start from fresh, unfortunately, with this. But Looks I'm like still it, yeah. absolutely loving All it. That's left is to right. flatten this town. And the... That's true. But this number of folks alone... I'm getting readings yeah. from several spots, spots around, around the city. city probably Aiming their from bases. there might Aiming be the best plan. From there, if we best attack plan the bases, right. that ought to lure some of those dimwits from... Eating around the bush. Come on, don't be like that. There's some time... So we're going to attack the bases. Right, okay. Exterminate the sons in the enemy base city. Hordes of foes await in the number of proportional. Okay, to the city's level. So they have different levels. Okay, so we basically just gotta fight a load of bases and draw people to it and just keep beating people down, to be honest. Oh, okay, so we've got a walkie talkie there. Holy crap! <laughs> right. What in the. Hey. Having a rough time, eh? Sure. Sure, let's go check it out. Why not? What base should we start from? Hey, Barda. You're dead set on charging into the city. I won't stop you. <laughs> well, you know, Tora. I'm kind of the boss around here. 
Oh, not a total pushover. Uh, one. Right. Okay. Uh, uh, so you total doing pushover. This. We can build some levels up there, but you know what? Let's just go for you. Let's go just right in up. and see what we can do. That's what Bardock wants to do, so why not? Who the hell are you? What a strange bunch. So you you'll get your allies over here if you know what's good. Uh, the invaders are here. Yeah, invaders, something like that. <laughs> Idiots of a time to beat feet. Oh, here we go. Going all in with Bardock. Let's go. Aren't you for some kind of fight? Wow, these guys really aren't that strong, are they? He's down, he's down. Okay, interesting. Same. We've got these as allies as well, Vardox. Uh, people that call up Vardox as well, so we'll try and use them as much as possible. I've not actually seen Saiyan Smash go for it. Bye. That was only a kill. If I've ever seen it, it's probably worth just doing this. That looks awesome. Since he's not going Super Saiyan or anything, that does look pretty cool. Right, let's just take out some people. Come on. We are just powering through them. They are no problems whatsoever. Let's do this and then this. I gotta say, Farsha sounds a little bit like Freezer. Which we will get to see throughout, so make sure you don't go anywhere. Alright, let's get the C combo in as well. Do as much as we can do here. We're at 104 out of 170. Can we do 66? 54, really? So close. Oh. Sorry, dude. You are finished. What? Over yeah, already? that wasn't too hard. <laughs> yeah, just like Dada said. Over already? Really? Just an A? Got it there, if I'll be honest. Put a fork okay. in the spot. It's done. So this one's done. Strag Smash and bash? All right. Smash and bash, eh? Destroying the bases. It's a bit like the freezer towers in the normal one, I guess. Uh, let's destroy them, shall we? Yeah, it is. Should we head to the next spot? Yeah. Let's keep going. Okay, so the enemy strength is level three now because we've taken out one of them. All right, we found another one. Let's go and take these guys down there. Hey guys. Who? Who are you people? No point introducing them. We're just out and about for leisurely stroll. Seems like they've come from the. All according to. Well, all according to plan. Let's get into it. All right. Let's start with these guys right here. How many of these do I need to fight, do you think? We've just taken out a load of them already. 145, which is less than last one, to be fair. It shouldn't take anywhere near as long. Right, we are getting close now. Wow, I wonder if they thought they had a chance against us. We are just... Going through them like a hot knife through butter. Right, you now. Do they really think this was going to go well for them? They only got one guy that time. Thank you, random box. Enemy strength level has gone down. Let's just destroy this. And then I guess we'll just go and find another one. Okay, so we've got them down to level two. And it looks like there's another one around here somewhere. Which is a little bit of a lower level. There they are. Yep, you've already reported it to the city, have ya? Okay. That's kind of what they want. Let's just do this. Do that. And we may as well spark as well. Why not? Lots of uh, action going on in this DLC, to be honest, isn't there? Okay, cool. Take you out. You're gone. You're gone. Time. Yeah, cool. Okay, this. Don't even think about trying to hit me. Okay, this. 
Seven, eh? Oh, we can go again? Absolutely crazy. I suppose we are attacking a lot. Take this. Out. Take this. Really? Is that what we got? You thought you could deal with me. So, what were you going to do again? Beat me, was it? I don't think it was. I was hoping I'd have a little more fun. Same. So, we're getting close to uh, whittling down that city then. What do we get for doing that, I wonder? Okay, let's try this again. Let's go into the city. Let's go. We'll do it. I think we'll be fine. They're not really. Um, You've been on quite the road. But don't think we'll ever let you touch this city! Uh, okay. Uh, better show that spunk while you can. Yeah. You're outmatched. Don't it? <laughs> My fellow Knossons, we must defend our planet! Knossons. <laughs> defend well, best you yeah. can. We won't let you have Let's do this, this, and this. Why not? So we got to defeat 210 of these guys. Come at me, bro. I mean, good luck, mate. You are literally by yourself. You're gonna protect this planet all by yourself, are ya? Go for a save, man. Cool, 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 cool. And there he goes. Nice. So there we go. We've destroyed the city by the looks of it. Okay. Well, we are great apes now. Are we? No, we're still clearing up. It's giving me vibes of the androids, to be honest. If I, like I said, they're coming across a little bit this time. Right. It's time to turn great ape. You bastards are done. Just stare at the moon. So they had a lot more control over the uh, Uzara food. Oh, look at that! They have a lot better um, control over it, the Uzara form, a bit like Vegeta, than Goku and that did. Oh, it'd be awesome if you could play as one of them, wouldn't it? Very good visuals, though. Yeah, well, that's what you get when you shoot a giant monkey wearing armor in the face. Damn, that's a lot of explosions. And here is the aftermath. So this should be where Bardo gets like hit Damn. or whatever it is, and the visions and all that sort <laughs> That's of stuff. That's what you get for not being more careful. Yeah, I should guess. But yeah, Bardock. Guess we went pretty hard celebrating your son's birth and all. Yeah, something like that. Celebrating my son's birth. <laughs> sure, whatever. We're done here, so you should head back to Planet Vegeta and see the little tyke. Yeah, well, yeah. Why the hell would I waste my time with that pathetically hopeless pipsqueak? Wow. What kind hopeless? of fool do you take me for? <laughs> Count me out, eh? You know, guys, we ought to thank Lord Frieza. Fool. He's been treating us good for a long time now. That's What's it. Lord Frieza want with a dump of a planet like this anyway? Just well, all, supposedly, there's some sort of weird psychic energy on this rock. At least not sure if Lord Freezer really believes that. 
But I hear he's been after it for quite a long time now. Well. Here it comes. Let's sit back and enjoy this. There is one left by himself. Tulo! I actually gave him a name, nice. I can't remember if that was in the original series. There it is. Yeah, right in the back of the neck. I'm sure he had a big speech first, didn't he? Oh, um, yeah, whilst he's on fire. Wouldn't want to see that in a dark alley. He caught me off guard. Hear me. Just now, I've hit you with my fabled future punch technique. Right. You should now see that you and your kind are doomed. Future punch? What the hell are you talking about? There is nothing, nothing but annihilation in your future. You will all be wiped out, just like what happened to us. How does it feel knowing the future? Knowing that your days are numbered? No idea. <laughs> That's enough! Well, he went a bit overboard there, but that did look cool. What a joke! The Saiyan race is unbeatable! That guy honestly thought we'd suffer? Give me a break! Hey, Bardock! Bardock! Hey, Bardock! Step out of it! Bardock! The hell's wrong with you? What are you doing? Bardock! He's just chilling, bro. Long day work. Okay, so we heading back to Vegeta now? Oh, it's Frieza, okay. Lord Frieza. We've just received word that planet Kanasa is ours. Nice. Good. That puts us about one month ahead of schedule. Nice. Right hand man oh, and okay. attendant. Salvan of the Who is in charge of clearing out the band of insignificant low class Saiyan warriors? Huh? Hmm? Saiyans. Frieza. Those guys have been putting in the work lately. Yeah. Some of them are indeed remarkable. Take that Prince Vegeta, for example. He possesses a power level well beyond his... And that's not all. Individually, they don't amount to much. But in large numbers... Heh. <laughs> you sound scared. <laughs> Hardly. But they could prove to be a nuisance, I mean. There's no telling when another Vegeta will show up. And if enough True. of them were to rally behind a saying like that... They would become a thorn in... Oh. <laughs> Yeah, something like that. So, how's he doing? In the healing pod well, we physically are. physically speaking, he's completely healthy. But his brain waves are another matter. Yeah. Nothing we can do about it. I guess Bardock's gonna have to sit this one out. What? No, I'm awake, dude. What happened to me? Sounds a bit like Vegeta. What the hell's going on? What is this? There is nothing. Nothing but a night. Oh, these the visions. Future. You will all be wiped out. Just like what happened to us. How does it feel and he's knowing visions the future? Of Goku and that. Knowing that your days are numbered. Bardock, you've yeah. awakened. Yeah, man. Hold on, I'll open the capsule for you. What's not gonna wait? Was that just now? Ah, we're dream? all suited and booted. No, it was different. It felt so it real. Felt yeah. So planet blowing up. A pod heading for a. <laughs> what a bunch of crap. You seem to be having a nightmare. Are you? Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I'm yeah. built better than nightmare guys sure. like you. That's a bit rude, isn't Where it? Are <laughs> the others? They were dispatched to Planet Meat under the orders Planet of Meat. Lord Freeze. What? Damn it! Well, Planet as we Meat, know uh, in the future, it's a bit of a booby trap. Bardock! 
Wade's Bardock. Oh, Kakarot. Are we going to get to see like a nice little uh, Broly next to him? No, we're just going to see Kakarot. How does it feel? <laughs> No, we're not. There's no Broly next to him. Okay. Cackle. Cackle. A power. Garbage. Two. That's really low. All right, bro. Well, I think that is that for this part. We will break it up into parts because I think we've got a lot more coming to us. As we know, when we go to Planet Meat, we will probably come into right contact with Doria and those men as well, and, and his men as well. If you're enjoying the Kakarot content, guys, let me know down below There's and no make way. sure to hit that like and subscribe as well. Obviously, if you guys are enjoying it, I will carry it on. And if you're interested in seeing the earlier DLCs as well, like I said, let me know down below. But for now, we'll call that as part one. Thank you very much for watching. Until next time, I'll catch you later. Ciao.